Your time? 4.30. Fill me up. That's your sixth cup. Yes, it is. How about some tea? Absolutely. Throw it in with the coffee. I assume Rory's meeting you here? Yes, she is, and she's late, and I have to go to class tonight, so that means I have 10 more minutes. I got it. You did? Right here. Oh, well, hurry up. Open it. Leave the pot, Ethel. I'm just an enabler. Okay, just remember, these are the PSATs, okay? So it's like the baby gap. They don't count as much. Plus, you can take them over again. Plus, you are very young. You have years of learning ahead of you. And the really important thing is that you tried very hard. I got a 740 verbal and a 760 math. Oh, thank God, you're not an idiot. I got a 740 verbal and a 760 math? Those are damn good scores, little lady. Really amazing, top notch. Those are PSAT-rific. Sorry, I was just lying there. I had to go for it. You're frowning. How did I get a higher score in math? Who cares? But I'm stronger in verbal. Verbal is my thing. No, verbal's my thing. Maybe I didn't study hard enough. Maybe I got cocky. Maybe you need a major mud bath salt glow chill pill combo. I'm just saying. Rory, you got a great score. Yeah, but... No, a great score. A great score? That is a score you have earned and you deserve and will allow you to look down on me for many years to come. Okay. Okay. So we should celebrate. Hey, how about we get all dressed up tonight and hit the Rocky Horror Picture Show? Are you serious? Please, I'm always serious. Can I invite Lane? Absolutely. Okay. I hope she gets this in time. She's been kind of hard to reach lately. I don't know. Maybe she can't handle the pressure of having such a brilliant best friend. Mm -hmm. Brilliant in math. The verbal's kind of sad. Thank you. You're late. Oh, shoot, I am. I have to go. Hey, Rory kicks a major PSAT ass today. Yeah, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> and to celebrate, we're going to hit the Rocky Horror Picture Show tonight. Really? Yes, I am Magenta. Rory usually opts for Janet. And I had a thought. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I was thinking that you could put on some fishnet stockings, a leather teddy, some platform boots, and go with us as Dr. Frankenfurter. Hmm, well, now that is a thought. You'll also need some gloves and a wig. Gloves, wigs, got it. I'll do your makeup. Oh, that'll be a help. There you go. Okay, sounds great. Great. So, 8 o'clock, I'll swing around and get you? Sure, good. Good. Oh, hey, if by some chance you knock on the door but no one answers, even though all the lights are on, I'll just meet you there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, I'll see you tomorrow morning? Yeah, I'll be the one with the coffee. <laughs> hey, make sure you gloat a little. It's good for the skin. <laughs> well, how's it look? It's dark. Hand me the flashlight. Why don't you have one of those hats with the lights on them? I flip burgers for a living. Right, right. Okay. I think I've seen enough. Well, how was it? Is there like a termite housing development under there? Golf courses and condos with rec rooms? It's actually not too bad. Well, what do you know? You flip burgers for a living. I mean, there's definitely a little damage. Yeah, but, but, but Kirk says that the joists were totally gone. Yeah, there are. And, and that the foundation had lost all its structural integrity. That's true, too. OK, great. So I'm still screwed. Necessarily. Look, I, I need $15,000, which I, I can't find, don't have, and if I don't find, the house is going to fall down. I can help you with that. You can? Yeah, I can get a couple guys who can get in there and do the work. You can fix this? Well, I can help. I know a good contractor. He did some work on the diner. What about the money? Oh, you won't have to deal with that right away. I won't? No, you can pay it out in installments if you want, monthly, bi-monthly, whatever, whatever you're comfortable with. So, let me get this straight. Uh, you and some guys who actually know what they're doing are going to come over and fix my house, and I can pay them back whenever I want? That's right. Because I'm Tony Soprano? Only scarier. <laughs> now, Luke, when I finally do make out this installment check, uh, who should I make it out to? Well, you can uh, make it out to me, if you like. Oh, so basically you would be fronting me the money. Well... Yeah, but it's no big deal. Luke, that's a loan. No, it's just a temporary exchange of money for services that will be paid back when you finally have the... It's a loan. <laughs> Man, you suck as a liar. Thank you. You're welcome. I can't take it. I know, but it was worth a shot. Hey, uh, Dean, call twice. Rah, rah, rah. You too. Uh... Don't ask. Okay. So what are you going to do? 